Hello. This is a book called The Boy, the Mole, the Fox, and the Horse by Charlie Mackesy. And I'm reading you the book because we are going to use this as inspiration for a little drawing project. And I think that you will love it. I love it mostly because of the messages and because of the sweet way that Charlie does his drawings. Now, he has a little introduction here, but I'll read that at school because I just want you to absorb the words and the illustrations that are absolutely delightful. Hello? I'm so small, said the mole. Yes, said the boy, but you make a huge difference. What do you want to be when you grow up? Kind, said the boy. What do you think success is, asked the boy. To love, said the mole. Well, hello. Do you have a favorite saying, asked the boy. Yes, said the mole. What is it? If at first you don't succeed, have some cake. I see. Does it work? Every time. I got you a delicious cake, said the mole. Did you? Yes. Where is it? I ate it, said the mole. Oh, but I got you another. Did you? Where is that one? The same thing seems to have happened. What do you think is the biggest waste of time? Comparing yourself to others, said the mole. I wonder if there is a school of unlearning. Most of the old moles, I know, wish they had listened less to fears and more to their dreams. What is that over there? It's the wild, said the mole. Don't fear it. Imagine how we would be if we were less afraid. I'm not afraid, said the mole. If it wasn't caught in it in this snare, I'd kill you. If I wasn't caught in this snare, I'd kill you, said the fox. If you stay in that snare, you will die, said the mole. So the mole chewed through the wire with his tiny teeth. One of the greatest freedoms is how we react to things. I've learned how to be in the present. How, asked the boy. I find a quiet spot and shut my eyes and breathe. That's good. And then? Then I focus. What do you focus on? Cake, said the mole. Isn't it odd? We can only see our outsides, but nearly everything happens in the inside.
Be careful not to fall. Oh. oh, poor guy. So much beauty we need to look after. Being kind to yourself is one of the greatest kindnesses, said the mole. We often wait for kindness, but being kind to yourself can start now, said the mole. Often, the hardest person to forgive is yourself. Sometimes I feel lost, said the boy. Me too, said the mole. But we love you, and love brings you home. I think everyone is just trying to get home, said the mole. Hello. Hello. Doing nothing with friends is never Nothing, is it? asked the boy. No, said the mole. You fell but I've got you. Everyone is a bit scared, said the horse, but we are less scared together. Tears fall for a reason, and they are your strength, not weakness. What is the bravest thing you have ever said, asked the boy? Help, said the horse. When have you been at your strongest, asked the boy, when I have dared to show my weakness? Asking for help isn't giving up, said the horse. It's refusing to give up. Sometimes I worry you'll all realize I'm ordinary, said the boy. Love doesn't need you to be extraordinary, says the mole. We all need a reason to keep going, said the horse. What's yours? You three, said the fox. Getting home, said the boy. Cake, said the mole. I've discovered something better than cake. No, you haven't, said the boy. I have, replied the mole. What is it? A hug. It lasts longer. Nothing beats kindness, said the boy, said the horse. It sits quietly 
beyond all things. Sometimes, said the horse. Sometimes what, asked the boy. Sometimes just getting up and carrying on is brave and magnificent. How do they look so together and perfect, asked the boy. There's a lot of frantic paddling going on beneath, said the horse. The greatest illusion, said the mole, is that life should be perfect. Is it the moon, asked the boy. It's a teacup stain, said the mole. And where there's tea, there's cake. Be curious. Life is difficult, but you are loved. So you know all about me, asked the boy. Yes, said the horse. And you still love me? We love you all the more. Sometimes I think you believe in me more than I do, said the boy. You'll catch up, said the horse. The fox never really speaks, whispered the boy. No, and it's lovely. He is with us, said the horse. To be honest, I often feel I have nothing interesting to say, said the fox. Being honest is always interesting, said the horse. There's something I haven't told you, said the horse. What's that, said the boy. I can fly, but I stopped because it made the horse jealous. Well, we love you. Whether you can fly or not. Okay. If your glass, is your glass half empty or half full, asked the mole. I think I'm grateful to have a glass, said the boy. We don't know about tomorrow, said the horse. All we need to know is that we love each other. When the dark clouds come, Keep going. When the big things feel out of control, focus. Focus on what you love right under your nose. This storm will pass. After the storm, we have such a long way to go, sighed the boy. Yes, but look how far we've come, said the horse. Sometimes I want to say I love you all, said the mole, 
but I find it difficult. Do you, said the boy? Yes, so I say something like, I'm glad we are all here. Okay, said the boy, I'm glad we are all here. We are so glad you are here too. What's your best discovery, asked the mole, that I'm enough. I'm enough as I am, said the boy. I've realized why we are here, whispered the boy. For cake, asked the mole. To love, said the boy, and be loved, said the horse. What do we do when our hearts hurt, asked the boy. We wrap them with friendship, shared tears and time till they make hopeful, they wake hopeful and happy again. Do you have any other advice, asked the boy. Don't measure how valuable you are by the way you are treated, said the horse. Always remember, you matter. You're important and you are loved and you bring this and you bring to this world things no one else can. Home isn't always a place, is it? Thank you. Look how far we've come. I will read the rest in class. We're going to do some very fun things with this book. I'm looking forward to it. Charlie Mackesy will be a huge inspiration for this fun little project we are going to do. Can't wait to try it out.